Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Bioshock 2. Last time we made our way through Fontaine Futuristics, spared Gil Alexander, and finally arrived at Sophia Lamb's lair, the Persephone Penal Colony. Let's pick it up right there. Nvidia. Once we're logged into games for Windows and the intro is done playing anyway. Okay. I am sorry if my voice sounds a little weak. I'm fighting off a cold, but... These videos take so long to upload, and I'm so busy that even if I am a little sick, if I have the free time to make a recording, I feel like I ought to. This one will be fairly short, though, just because we're hurtling towards the end game, and <coughs> Persephone is quite a bit shorter than the rest of it. I don't know why it didn't log us in in the first place. There we go. Alright, let's get started. Hopefully. Persephone Detention Facility. Just to remind us what our goal is, find Eleanor Lamb. This is it. Eleanor, your little sister, is held somewhere inside Lamb's Lair, Persephone Penal. You need to reunite with Eleanor to live and hopefully escape rapture. Locate Eleanor Lamb and reestablish your bond. All our research is done. Alright, let's move along. Not seeing anything in this room. Security checkpoint A. Inmate checkpoint. Have personal blue files ready for examination. Please keep both hands visible while unrestrained. Remain behind the painted line. <coughs> behind the desk we have armor piercing rounds, a remote hack dart, and $13. Can't see anything outside. Let's move right along. Fifty caliber rounds, eleven dollars, sixteen fifty caliber rounds in that crate, six dollars and six rivets in that one. Let's keep on moving. I wonder, Delta, do you know why you are here? Have you any idea what my daughter has given you? As I watch you now, I envy your ignorance. You still believe. Quiet, no talking beyond this point. That message was... Lamb, ignorance. Just sitting here, ripe for the use, is the 12th out of 14 Power to the People stations. Make a note of that for myself. And I am now going to take... Let's see... The drill reflector upgrade doesn't really seem worthwhile. I think I'll use my last three to upgrade the spear gun. Let's do the damage increase first. Uh. 
And let's keep moving. Daddy's home. Over here, we've got a first aid kit on the ground. An ammo bandito I'll need to hack. And a circus of values I'll also need to hack. Oops. Anti-personnel rounds. Not a bad freebie, but of course I'm maxed out on those. Drill fuel. Alright. Let's max everything out now. Rivets. Frag grenades. Mini turrets. Heat seeking rockets. And missing two trap spears, but that's okay. We should be fully loaded on everything now, which is kind of awesome. Oh, uh, let's update the saves and pause to avoid desync. <coughs> All right, back to work. Quarantine area. Eve Hypo, 550 caliber rounds, canned beans. A diary, selling Ryan short. Persephone, secret home of Sinclair Solutions. I bet against Andy Ryan's vision of harmony and rapture, offered him a quiet place to send anybody who wasn't working out, and now I'm sitting on my own private think tank. Technically, Utopia shouldn't have much use for a detention facility, but if you do business as long as I have, well, you learn to pick a brand name from the writing on the wall. Cream-filled cake and two dollars in that cabinet. 00 buck and four dollars in that one. Two rivets and canned beans there. Spear ammo, fresh water, and four dollars. Another Eve hypo. A bot shutdown panel I almost missed. And here is a dormant security bot. Let's hack it. Make it our friend. His name's Wade, and I only just noticed I was going at 30 frames per second, which is atrocious. Now let's update the saves and pause to avoid desync again. Alright, let's get to work. Quarantine area. Atrium. One with her. That's her, son. Eleanor Lamb. No matter what you might be feeling right now, this is business. Get that cage open. She's coming with us. 50 caliber rounds. That message was Sinclair, open the cage. Storage crate, $7 in spear ammo. A gene bank. Next to the machine, ammo vending machine is a first aid kit. Let's hack the ammo vending machine. Let's do a slightly better job than that. Rivet. Six dollars, six rivets, and a pep bar. Two spear ammo, seven dollars. 
Office of Dr. Sophia Lamb. There's Eleanor, asleep on the bed. Let's explore the rest of this area first. Hey, there's money over here. Fifteen dollars, fifteen dollars. Awesome. Let's head over here now. Hack the health station. Persephone detention facility. Bandages, a first aid kit. Eleven dollars, two double O buck, and a circus of values I'll need to hack. Damn it! There we go. Spear ammo. <clears throat> okay. Let's make our way up to Eleanor now. Goal completed. Find Eleanor Lamb. New goal, activate the quarantine chamber. Before we do that... Let's look at that goal. Activate the quarantine chamber. Eleanor is being held by Lamb inside a sealed quarantine chamber. The chamber airlock needs to go through a decontamination process before you will be allowed inside. This may take some time. Hit the switch on the quarantine chamber to start the decontamination process. Now's a good time to update the saves. And start prepping, because we are going to have to fight two big sisters at the same time. In fact, let's... That tank she's in. Use the controls to break the quarantine seal. There's nothing in here I can hypnotize, because big sisters are always immune. So, let's set up a couple of mini turrets. What are you waiting for, kid? Shut up, Sinclair. Do I not look busy to you? Get heat-seeking rockets ready to go. Decoy first, which I'll quickly follow with electrovolts. All right, let's hit it. But first, let's look at his irritated messages. Sinclair, use the controls. Sinclair, get going. How will she remember us after this moment? I have placed my pieces on the board. As expected, as have you. Is this what she hoped for? Mother and father, locking eyes. Yet still we are blind. Goodbye, Subject Delta. And take heart, for you, at least, have escaped your legacy. So, new goal, defeat the big sisters. Eleanor is locked away in a sealed quarantine chamber, which is currently undergoing a decontamination process. Lamb is taking advantage of this for one last attempt to stop you. Defend yourself against the big sisters until the quarantine chamber is open. Radio messages. Lamb, mother and father. Anything on here? I don't think so. Forty Adam, two first aid kits, and fifty dollars. There we go. 
quarantine chambers waiting on you. Get in there! 40 Adam, Eve Hypo, $49. Let's pick up those first aid kits I saw around the room. <coughs> that actually wasn't that bad, although they did shred. What are you waiting for, kid? Shut up, Sinclair. They did shred my mini turrets and my bot friends, but we bagged them, so... Radio messages. Sinclair, get her out. Goal, enter the quarantine chamber. Your long journey is almost over. Eleanor waits for you on the other side of the sealed quarantine chamber. The way is now open. Just head into the decontamination chamber and wait for the process to finish. Before we do that, let's update the saves and pause to avoid desync. All right. Okay, let's do this. Your okay, so we completed that goal. New radio message from Sinclair. Signal breaking up. Look at her, Delta. Ten years. And still she dreams of you. Fifty seconds remaining. Do you know why Eleanor brought you here? She wanted a father. So she found a way to restore you in body and mind. watching you ever since, exalting your every act as gospel. The girl lying on that bed is no longer my child, nor my life's work. She is a monster, shaped by you alone. Just as she has always wanted. Twenty seconds remaining. But there is one detail of your mutual bond she failed to account for. Your body was designed to lapse into a coma when her heart ceases to beat. Eleanor, forgive me. But if he dies of trauma, he will return elsewhere. Full restraints at all times. No one enters this room until he expires. Father, it's me, Eleanor. I'm so sorry. Mother stopped my heart long enough to sever our bond. Staying near me won't stop you from dying now. Or worse. But I can still help you escape. This little sister's brought you something that will allow you to take control of her. Shh. Okay, now this is pretty cool. You have taken control of a little sister. You can now use vents and gather Adam from bodies. I know this feels a bit strange, Father. But now you can see through her eyes and tell her where to go. This is how I brought you back without Mother catching on. Now, first, let's get you out of here. New goal, escape the holding room. First, let's 
Goal, escape the holding room. When Lamb suffocated Eleanor, your mutual bond broke. Your body is now shutting down, and you may not have long to live. Lamb has taken advantage of this to secure you in one of Persephone Penal's holding rooms. Eleanor, weak as she is, is the only one who can help you now. She has used her power over the Little Sisters to transfer control of one to you. Use the Little Sisters' ability to crawl through Rapture's vents to escape the holding room. Messages. Eleanor, take control of the sister. Eleanor, through the vent. Anything else? No. But first, let's update the saves and pop. Oh, I can't save. Crawl through the vent there. Yeah, no saving allowed. So I guess I'm not in danger. I hope not, anyway. Eleanor, through the vent. So, as you can see, the little sisters see everything very differently. I'm guessing that's how the splicers look to a sister. This is what the world looks like. It's all very pretty and nice. Alright, let's get out of the room. Through the vent. As instructed. Well, I may not be able to save, but I can still pause to avoid desync, and I feel like I need to. Alright. So I can still pick up items. Got an Eve hypo there. I'm not sure what these things are, but I can't pick them up. So we'll go ahead and go through the vent now. Escape the holding room. Now, inside Mother's office, there's a way to unlock these chambers she's holding us in. Find a way to slip in there. New goal, infiltrate Lamb's office. When Lamb suffocated Eleanor, your mutual bond broke, your body is now shutting down, and you may not have long to live. Lamb has taken advantage of this to secure you in one of Persephone Penal's holding rooms. Eleanor, weak as she is, is the only one who can help you now. She has used her power over the Little Sisters to transfer control of one to use. You will need access to the rest of Persephone Penal. As a Little Sister, you should be able to sneak into Lamb's office unnoticed and gain access to the rest of the facility. Head to Lamb's office and use the security release lever to open the way forward. Radio message, Eleanor, into Mother's office. money. Let's make sure we pick it all up. Hidey hole. Big statue of a big daddy. Another vent. Oh. This is the quarantine room. I guess it's time to head through this vent now. <laughs> Office of Sophia Lamb. You're in. There should be a lever in here somewhere. Pull it. And it will unlock ourselves. Goal completed. Infiltrate Lamb's office. New goal. Use the security release lever. When Lamb suffocated Eleanor, your mutual bond broke. Your body is now shutting down, and you may not have long to live. Lamb has taken advantage of this to secure you in one of Persephone Penal's holding rooms. Eleanor, weak as she is, is the only one who can help you now. She has used her power over the Little Sisters to transfer control of one to you. You will need access to the rest of Persephone Penal. Use the security release lever in Lamb's office to open the way. Radio message. Eleanor, pull the lever. Attention. 
attention. Augustus Sinclair has been sighted within the facility. He will attempt to reach Subject Delta. All family duties are hereby suspended until he is found. Let's pick up the money off of Lamb's desk. Seems like she's not going to notice us, which is good. Before we hit the lever, let's explore back here. See what else we can find. With a diary, withholding visitation. Oh, we'll have to listen to the diaries later. Alright, well, let's hit the controls. <coughs> Goal completed. Use the security release lever. What Mother did to me left me very weak, or I would do this part myself. To save your life, I'm going to have to change to be like you. From here, you should be able to locate the pieces of a big sister suit. Please, bring them to me. New goal, find the three big sister suit parts. New goal, find the big sister armor. New goal, find the big sister helmet. New goal, find the big sister weapon. Alright. Find the three big sister suit parts. Eleanor has enough power to help you break to help you break you out and get you on your feet, but she's still weak from Lamb's attack. In order to help further, she's going to need to become stronger. She will need to become a big sister. Parts for a big sister suit are scattered around Persephone Penal. Find the three pieces to complete a suit for Eleanor and take it back to her. Find the big sister armor. Eleanor has enough power to help you break you out and get you on your feet, but she's still weak from Lamb's attack. In order to help further, she's going to need to become stronger. She will need to become a big sister. Parts for a big sister suit are scattered around Persephone Penal. The big sister armor should be somewhere around the infirmary. Find it and the other two pieces and take them back to Eleanor. Find a big sister helmet. Eleanor has enough power to help you break you out and get you on your feet, but she's still weak from Lamb's attack. In order to help further, she's going to need to become stronger. She will need to become a big sister. Parts for a big sister suit are scattered around Persephone Penal. A big sister armor should be somewhere around the repair shop. Find it and the other two pieces and take them back to Eleanor. Find a big sister weapon. Eleanor has enough power to help you break you out and get you on your feet, but she's still weak from Lamb's attack. In order to help further, she's going to need to become stronger. She will need to become a big sister. Parts for a big sister suit are scattered around Persephone Penal. A big sister weapon should be somewhere around the guard room. Find it and the other two pieces and take them back to Eleanor. Radio message. Eleanor building a big sister suit. Uh, before we head up there, let's make sure there's nothing to be gained from backtracking. And also, let me make a mental note that we have audio logs to listen to. Everything from withholding visitation forward. <coughs> well, Eleanor's room hardly counts as backtracking. Oh, an Eve hypo! It's good, I might have missed that. Can't head in there yet. Splicers, I suppose. Daddy is the best. Okay, I can get back into Delta's holding room. And back here, money. Well, I guess there was money to be gained. And... Get to look at these handsome-looking chaps. I'm excited to see what they really look like when we get back inside Delta, but... In the meantime, let's do... Search this room really quickly. Quarantine chamber. can't seem to do anything in here anyway, so... Onward it is! Oh, 
Let's go up these stairs then. Interesting statue. Daddy meets Dr. Gilbert. Interesting. Daddy is so strong. Got some s people looking at the artwork here. Let's pick up the money on the ground. Another diary. Blessing in disguise. Still can't listen. We've got three more here. Over here, there's an Eve hypo. Angel. If we go up these stairs, another daddy is so strong. A locked door, a fireplace. And this door here. With a lovely trail of rose petals. I am still barred from saving the game, but let's pause to avoid desync right quick. Okay, just really quickly, the uh, this statue changes based on what you did with Gil Alexander. I'm not sure what it is if you kill him, but here it shows me saving someone from a big monster. As we head in here, this, all good girls gather. This is an angel from which we can gather some Adam. Might as well. Oh, reality. <laughs> Collected 40 Adam. Oh, maybe I should have left Proud Parent on. Would have been 60. Well, maybe not. Anyway, let's head down the stairs. Keep on going. Got some money on the table. All good girls gather. Got a busted Big Daddy doll here. Locked room. Let's head into this one. All right, you little brat. Get over here. Oh, yep. Saw what he really looked like for the briefest instant. set up here. Daddy is the best. Angel. Daddy meets Aunt Gracie. I guess that's me s sparing Grace Holloway. Again, don't know what it looks like if you killed her, but it doesn't matter. Let's pause again to avoid desync. Okay, back to work. Still can't save. Let's head up here. Right or straight? Let's try straight first. Ten years, father. Stuck in this, this fever dream. Mother kept me sedated in order to perfect my mind with Adam. To her, the ideal child is a genius, serving the common good without questioning it. You have saved me from that. All right, that radio message. Eleanor, you have saved me. And by the way, starting now, I think Eleanor's radio messages change depending on whether you were good or evil throughout the course of the game. There's a piece of the suit in here, Father. Find the rest and bring them back to me. Okay, that message. Eleanor, the first piece. Lovely. Big Sister Armor. Goal completed. Find the Big Sister Armor. Very good. Let's keep going then. Splicers. Just eyeballing me. Angel. All good girls gather. Event. Let's head in here. Why the door shut on me, I don't know. 
Okay, seriously, what's up with this? Uh, I guess we're supposed to take the vent. Another angel. Let's pick up this Eve hypo. Let's gather. <laughs> Forty Adam. Got some money here. And door controls. Oh, now we can get out of here. Okay, good. I guess we should just keep going. Every day is Daddy's Day. We're now in the repair shop. Got some money here. Books. Applied Headology. Evolutionary Biology, Dawkins Law, Mendelian Practice, interesting, Practical Eugenics, gross, anyway. A diary, behind mother's back, money, and the big sister helmet. Goal completed, find the big sister helmet. And here is... Daddy meets Uncle Stanley. Again, I saved him, so... Let's head up these stairs, then. Splicers. The other sisters are made from me, in part. As they grow up in rapture, I feel it all. When you were with the little ones, they trusted you as their father, because of me. Alright, we got some splicers here in the middle of the room. A first aid kit. Here's a diary, or er, an angel. You should gather right quick. Always safe with daddy. Always stay close to a friend. Alright, we're on the other side of that door now. Hidey hole we've already seen. Another... F another first aid kit. I hear an angry big sister somewhere. And in the meantime, we've got an Eve hypo on the ground. And the big sister weapon. Goal completed. Find the big sister weapon. Goal completed. Find the three big sister suit parts. New goal. Bring the big sister suit to Eleanor. <coughs> Eleanor has enough power to help you break you out and get you on your feet, but she's still weak from Lamb's attack. In order to help further, she's going to need to become stronger. She will need to become a big sister. You have all the parts of the suit. Bring them to Eleanor back in the quarantine chamber. And I think I never mentioned. Radio messages. Eleanor, you have saved me. Eleanor, the first piece. Eleanor, the least of these. No new help messages, so I think we just backtrack now. That's still closed, so... All the way back. The human animal, like the gene, 
serves only the self. We are born believing that the world turns for us alone, and we die in the futile attempt to make it so. I've treated them all, from career prostitutes to titans of industry. The only constant is dissatisfaction. Sorry about that. Mother was right about one thing. I have been watching you, Father. Studying the way you have treated others. And now I know who I am. That message was Eleanor, Father's Daughter. my new sisters, I felt every one, and it gave me hope for the first time in years. I guess we flash to reality to notice that Sophia is gone. Eleanor, freedom and hope. Now I almost missed underneath the bed, freeing father. One last audio diary. Uh, we'll give her the big sister suit in just a second. We still can't save, but I'm going to pause to avoid desync. And we're back. Let's give her the big sister suit. Goal completed. Bring the big sister suit to Eleanor. Now I will do the same for all the others. Starting with this one. We've done it, Father. I'll be there soon. Alright, radio messages. Eleanor, following your example, Eleanor, we've done it. Oh, those were actually brute splicers. Good to know. These suits always did make me think of you, Father. I guess I still remember you in shining armor. But now it's my turn to fight for you. Achievement unlocked. Max plasmid slots. Take this plasmid. You can use it to call me to your side in a fight. Achievement unlocked. Reunion. New goal. Pick up the Summon Eleanor Plasmid. So really quickly... First I need to make note of that. She automatically gives you the 8th Plasmid slot at this juncture. So... That's that. That achievement is done. It's 31 out of 68. We also unlocked Reunion, which is just a basic story achievement, but that should be 32 out of 68. Let's go to the achievement screen really quick, just to peruse those. Thirty-two of sixty-eight. Reunion. Re reunited with your original little sister. And max plasmid slots. Fully upgraded to the maximum number of plasmid slots. Alright, new goal, pick up the Summon Eleanor Plasmid. Eleanor's transformation is complete. She can now fight by your side with all the power of a big sister. She won't be able to stay with you all the time, however. 
Pick up this plasmid to gain the ability to call on Eleanor for help. She will appear and fight by your side for a short amount of time. Radio messages. Eleanor, the armor of a knight. Eleanor, call me with this plasmid. And I think I actually need to pick it up. But before I do, yes, I can now save. So let's update the saves. The little, the little sister section is over. <coughs> and let's pick up that last plasmid. New plasmid, summon Eleanor. It's bring your daughter to work day. Summon Eleanor in her big sister form to help even the odds in overwhelming battles. We just unlocked another achievement too, all plasmids. Let me make note of that in my personal notes and we'll pull that up on the achievement screen. 33 of 68 achievements, all plasmids. Found or purchased all 11 basic plasmid types. Summon Eleanor in her big sister form to help even the odds in overwhelming battles. And we will put it in the empty slot. Summon Eleanor for a little help. Yes. Summon the big sister to fight by your side. Warning, nothing lasts forever. Goal completed. Pick up the Summon Eleanor plasmid. Press right mouse to summon Eleanor to fight with you. New goal, exit the area. You have reunited with Eleanor, but your body is still falling apart. You need to get out of Rapture if you have any chance of survival. Eleanor says you must meet with Sinclair in order to escape. Exit the area through the bulkhead door in the main atrium. Nothing new there, but we do have a plasmid description for Summon Eleanor. The Summon Eleanor plasmid allows you to call on your now grown little sister for help during combat. Press right mouse to Summon Eleanor. Eleanor will start by targeting any enemy you hit with the plasmid. However, she will stand by your side, continuing to fight any who get in your way for the duration of the plasmid's effect. While she is summoned, she can be retargeted by hitting another foe with the plasmid. Eleanor's big sister suit and years of atom ingestion make her a powerful ally who can even the odds in even the most overwhelming combat situation. Not bad. Alright, let's get out of here now. This present has all the items our little sister picked up. $80, two first aid kits, and five e hypos. And now that I remember, we need to listen to the uh, audio logs we picked up. So let's go to Lamb, starting with Withholding Visitation. Eleanor is changing as Delta draws closer. In her sleep, she mutters about having witnessed moments from his journey here. She is beginning to resist the moral conditioning. Eleanor's bond with Delta is turning her from the daughter of the people back into a rebellious child whose voice I do not recognize. Worse, I suspect Eleanor of direct involvement in his return. I fear that to separate them, I may have to, to take measures for which I will be unable to forgive myself. Eleanor Lamb, Blessing in Disguise. Mother says that my condition is a blessing in disguise. She constantly reminds me that I was born for the express purpose of promoting her ideals. And now, she's trying to convince me to begin splicing with the same cocktail that drove Dr. Alexander mad. She thinks that my condition makes me immune to the damage. The surface is my only chance at freedom. Mother took the one person I knew from above and murdered him in front of my eyes. Father, if I could only find a way to bring him back. Eleanor Lamb behind Mother's back. I've been quarantined, but Mother's unaware of the extent of my connections to the new little sisters. I don't just empathize with them. I can control them directly. 
they are my hands and my eyes now. Better yet, we have found Father's body and took a gene sample. The girls are hiding the samples inside those dolls we used to make. It's only a matter of time before I work out a way to rig one of those Vita chambers to seek his genetic signature. And then, I can't wait to see Mother's face. Eleanor Lamb, freeing father. We've done it. Father is back, right under Mother's nose. I've contacted a woman named Tenenbaum through my sisters. We've worked out a way to free his mind inside that suit, to awaken the man inside the monster. Mother's entire belief structure is corrupt. And if I know one thing about Father, it's that he will believe in escape. Eleanor. It is time for you to accept your duty to the people. When you awake, you'll understand. No! Get away from me! Alright. Let me make sure there's nothing else here. Let's get out of here. Dead Brute Splicer. Four rivets, $20, 26 drill fuel. Just let Eleanor deal with these guys. Now what? Summoning her did burn an entire bar of Eve. That's not ideal. But I guess it's because she's so ri ridiculously powerful. Subject Delta, I know you can hear me. You have stolen my life's work, and with it, my only daughter. But Rapture is the house of monsters. The surface will not have us. And now, we shall be buried as a family, side by side. There's the other one. Oh God. She's going to drop this building into the trench. It's miles deep. We have to find Sinclair. Nice. Done and dusted, Father. All right, I have to say, Eleanor is awesome. Where's the other leadhead she just killed? Anyway, new goal, exit the area. Oh, we've seen that already. Radio message, Lamb, I will not allow this. Eleanor, find Sinclair. That's fine. Let's just wait till my health fills back up. Guess I don't care that much about finding the last splicer. And as we head through this bulkhead, we will end this relatively short chapter. And I will end my video. Goal completed. Exit the area. Loading Inner Persephone. Docking platform. There we go. Alright. Uh, looks like Eleanor's just chillin'. Let's update all the saves. Including making a new perma save, the last new one, since this is the last level. And a new quick save.
Let me make sure there's nothing new to look at in here. All right, and with that, we will call it a video. This has been Let's Play Bioshock 2. We have reunited with Eleanor, and she is all of a sudden quite the badass. Next time, we will attempt our final escape from Rapture and the end of the single-player portion of the base Bioshock 2 game. Until then, thank you all for watching. Bye-bye.